there are many ways to change the appearance of text on a slide ranging from basic buttons on the home tab for formatting font, style, size, color and paragraph characteristics to more advanced options such as animation or conversion to smart art graphics. Adding new slides On the home tab, in the slides group, click the arrow next to new slide. A gallery appears showing thumbnails of the various available slide layouts. Click the layout that you want for your new slide. The new slide now appears both on the slides tab and in the slide pane. If you want your new slide to have the same layout as the preceding slide, you can just click new slide instead of clicking the arrow next to it. Apply a new layout to a slide. On the slides tab, Click the slide that you want to apply a new layout to. On the Home tab, in the Slides group, click Layout and then click the new layout that you want. If required, additional placeholders are automatically created to contain that content. Copy a slide If you want to create two slides that are similar in content and layout, you can save work by creating one slide and then making a copy of that slide. On the Slides tab, right-click the slide that you want to copy and then click Copy on the shortcut menu. Still on the Slides tab, right-click where you want to add the new copy of the slide and then click Paste on the shortcut menu. You can also insert a copy of a slide from one presentation into another presentation. Rearrange the order of slides. On the Slides tab, click the slide that you want to move and then drag it to the location that you want. To select multiple slides, click a slide that you want to move and then press and hold Ctrl while you click each of the other slides that you want to move. In case the slides to be moved are in serial order, then click to select the first slide. Move up or down to the last slide. Press the Shift key and click to select the last slide. The whole set from the first to the last slide will be selected. Delete a slide. On the Slides tab, right-click the slide that you want to delete and then click Delete Slide. Save your presentation. It is a good idea to give a file name and save your presentation and then while working to keep saving the changes frequently. Click the File tab, then click on Save. The Save As dialog box appears. In the Save As list, select the folder or other location where you want to save your presentation. In the File Name box, type a name for your presentation or do nothing to accept the default file name and then click Save. From the keyboard, you can press Ctrl plus S or click Save in the Quick Access toolbar to save changes in your presentation quickly at any time.